guys good morning i have to be kind of quiet because i'm in my philly apartment mm. all right let me explain real quick i got a philly apartment so i made a whole moving vlog and i'm probably just gonna put it into this one because i did a really bad job of doing the moving vlog but um in the beginning of the moving vlog i explained really well why i'm living in philly like a lot of people think that i already did live in philly which like i lived in the suburbs of philly but now i also have a apartment in philly and i have my house in the suburbs still so i'm going to insert that clip now and explain all that to you guys this vlog is going to be so fun as you guys can tell by the title i am moving um i'm moving to philly and you might be really surprised because you're probably like i thought you lived in philly no um i live in the suburbs of philly but like you know how kids do that where they're like they live in like chicago and they're like yeah i'm like right outside of chicago that's me i'm like right outside of philly so when i went to college i was like that's what i told everybody like i live right outside of philly so i live in the suburbs of philly i'm like 40 minutes from the city from like center city like 40 minutes and yeah i am moving to philly part-time so i'm still keeping this house i'm not doing literally anything to this house it's staying exactly the same um i'm just getting another place down in the city with two roommates so i live here alone but i'm gonna have two roommates down in the city and i'm gonna be there like part-time and then here part-time um i still don't really know like exactly what my schedule is but yeah i just feel like it's the perfect time for me to move to philly um really cool things are happening with stride that would make sense for me to move into philly also like every time i'm in philly like in the city which i'm in there a ton lately i'm always just like i really want to live here and um a part of me feels really tied to this area because this is where stride is in like this area um but i know that i can't just like base my whole life off of my business i mean i am my business pretty much but I need to also have somewhat of a life. So uh, I just thought moving to Philly would be really, really good for me when I'm young, like I'm 21, I'm single, like I may as well do it now because um, I may never, may never get the opportunity to do it again. So I'm gonna be living with two girls. One is one of my employees and then the other one is her friend from college, um, Rachel and Michelle. Rachel works for me and then Michelle is Rachel's friend. So yeah, that's what's up. Um, I hope that made somewhat of sense. But yeah, now it's, uh, couple days later it's monday morning that was filmed on wednesday no tuesday so that was like six days ago um and then i had a bunch of other moving vlog stuff which i'll put in right here i showed nothing from the other day <laughs> but anyway i bought a whole bunch of stuff the other day literally vlogged none of it um but i'll show you guys like what the cars look like pack and stuff if you even care um but yeah it's moving day it's friday so i just got out of the shower i just had a little bit of oatmeal there like wasn't a ton to really even pack because like i'm not moving out of this house so it's not like it's kind of like I'm just packing like for college like for a dorm so it wasn't like insane to pack or anything like that so I just have like a couple boxes upstairs and then a couple of things I ordered on Amazon that I have to like put in like a bag and then bring it out to my car and clean out my car that's honestly the biggest thing is I have to clean out my car because I have so much crap in my trunk all I know is that I'm probably forgetting so much stuff and I'll be like damn it like I didn't pack this so I'm sure like this weekend I'm gonna be making like a huge run back here um but i mean like tomorrow i'm back in the studio tomorrow so i can like just stop back here before i go back to the city um but yeah i'm so happy to move i'm so excited to be moving i'm just so so excited for this new chapter and like what's to come so this is everything that i have packed that i'm bringing over it doesn't look like a lot because it's really not and also like i can like come home and get stuff so that's what I'm like wearing today and then that's my duffel bag that I'm gonna be bringing today too I don't know if anything's really gonna be going in it. Well, I should probably pack stuff in it. That makes sense But pretty much in there. I'm just gonna have this go back and forth between my houses like if I ever need to bring things we does not listen to me all right so i got ready and i got everything moved like downstairs what i need to move out to my car so i'm just going to take out some trash and clean out my trunk really quick and then bring things like up here and then i'm pretty much 
done here. So we packed, took like 10 minutes. Like I'm not kidding, like this isn't gonna be like the hardest move ever, but um, it's gonna be a lot of trips and I live like, so I haven't seen the apartment yet, but like I will soon. I'm so excited, but like I haven't seen it yet. Um, but I know that my bedroom's on like the second floor, like downstairs. So all I know is that, and it's Philly, so like it's street parking, like we don't have a garage. So I'm gonna have to make a lot of trips to and from the house and I have to go load up my dad's car now, so. My dad already packed the car, so I didn't have to do anything when I got here. You excited to move it? I'm very excited. Let's do this. I haven't showed anything since I got here yesterday. So this, is this is a moving vlog now. Maybe I should turn this off real quick. Look at my hair. <laughs> She's blonde, everybody. Don't worry, Tori didn't get another best friend. It's just still me? lazy. I'm just blonde. Um, I haven't showed you guys anything. Oh. Do you because... want to take it back? Well, you just go. film me. Okay. Oh, I <laughs> I haven't shown you guys anything because like the house is like still kind of like super messy, but we're working on it. I think Lindsay and I are gonna try and like finish everything tonight, mm -hmm. like be the builders and like build everything yeah. tonight. So um, I just got like my mattress set up and everything. We had a, her dad brought the box spring down, literally an angel scent. So um, I'm just gonna like put all my bedding on and stuff and like make my bed or whatever, and then make the tables and then. Help clean it's up the upstairs. Be a finished room, and I'll show you guys it um, it when it's done. But it's looking pretty good so far, if I do yeah. say so myself. No, it does look really good. We can sleep here tonight. Yeah, we can. We are sleeping here tonight. Mm -hmm. mm. Dance like you dance in high school. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. It's really hot in here. <laughs> Where's the egg? <laughs> oh my god, I'm sweating. <laughs> I love this song. Wow. First night in Philly check. <laughs> Yeah, so it's the next day, it's the morning, which is why I look so bad. Um, but it's 8.58 in the morning, it's Sunday. And I didn't show you guys my room last night, but I'll show it to you like in a couple of minutes when I like make my bed and stuff. Um, Instagram already saw it, so if you follow me on Instagram, you probably already saw it. Follow me on Instagram, Tori Sterling underscore. But anyway, yeah, we slept here last night. Linz, what do you think? Oh, look at our hoodies. That's what's oh yeah, we're matching. <laughs> I think Lindsay and I are going to like walk around and find breakfast because I don't know anywhere around this area. So obviously it's a little lived in right now, but this is what it looks like. Isn't it so cute? So my door is back here and I'll give you like a full tour later because we're going to breakfast and I'm pretty hungry. So you walk in, you get dresser. This is my closet in here. I don't have too many clothes here. Um, dresser, TV purse which I'm gonna bring, candle, salt rock lamp. I have like this little window thing which is cute. Nightstand, bed, other nightstand. My lamps are from Target, how cute are they? Oh, I need to turn the shades around so that the seam isn't on my side. And then um, my little desk. And we're gonna go to breakfast. Mm -hmm. And then this is the um, upstairs right now. It's kind of a freaking mess, but it's cause we have boxes everywhere. Totally fine. Like today's goal is to take all the boxes out. And then this is our kitchen. I think the goal today is like to kind of just like finish. Like I went to the bathroom, take these boxes out. And then Rachel's room is over here. And I think her goal is to finish too. So yeah. Oh, I think Michelle went shopping. Yeah, I think so. Yay. I need to go shopping too. So as you guys can see, I did a pretty bad job at my moving vlog because I didn't get like any content because when I move, I only think about moving, like I don't think about filming, so I did a really bad job with that. But it's fine, because now we're moved in. Um, but yeah, it's Monday morning now, so it's like 5.40 in the morning. I have a yoga class at 6.15 and I'm so excited to go. I'm gonna walk there, like it's gonna be so great. So I have to walk to my car real quick and grab my yoga mat in my car, and then head on down, I'm going to Core Power Yoga. I'm so, so excited, so. I'm gonna go. It's so nice to be able to like walk to yoga and then walk back. So I just got done yoga. 
walking back now. Um, and I'm gonna go to the farmer's market that's like right around the corner from my apartment. I'm like living my best life. It's Monday morning, it's like 7.30, I'm in a great mood. So I'm gonna go to the farmer's market and get just like some breakfast stuff. I got some yesterday, like I got oatmeal and stuff, but that's not at all what I'm feeling. And I want a juice and they have a juice there. They have like pressed juicery there, so I'm gonna get something there too, but life is so good. All right, I'm home. Obviously, I got ready, um, showered, curled my hair, just put some little waves in it. Um, I can definitely do a hair tutorial because a lot of people have been asking me since I got my extensions in. Um, so I can definitely do that. But I'm headed out now. It's like 9.30, so I'm going to head out. I'm going to hit Trader Joe's on the way into the studio. Then I'm going to hit uh, the studio, and then I'm going to be back in my uh, suburban house for the next couple days. Um, you guys will like, kind of catch on to like my whole little like what I do, I guess. I don't know. I'm still kind of figuring it out. Um, but we'll figure it out together. So yeah, I'm going to head on down to my other house and just be there for a while. I have a meeting at 1130 and then I teach tonight at five. So yeah, it's just all the norm. Look at that view. It never gets old. It's so pretty. I just made it back home. I went to Trader Joe's really quick on the way home and got a couple of things. Guys, I just love Trader Joe's. It's so inexpensive. I got like so much stuff for $24. Like it's just so cheap there. I just adore Trader Joe's. I just wish there was one a little closer. There's one close to me in the city, which is so great. But the one in the suburbs is like kind of far from where I live. So it's sort of annoying, but whatever. I'm headed off to the studio now. I'm really freaking cold. I think I'm gonna wear my parka. Thank God I brought this one home. I was like, I don't need my parka. But no, I do. I'm just so cold. I wanted to make a matcha, but I definitely don't have time because it's 11.15 now. My meeting's in 15 minutes. So, no time for a matcha, but that's all right. I can make one later. Man, we were right here like three seconds ago, man. Uh, we're still here. It's just a little bit later. Um, I went to the studio for my meeting, got obviously caught up in a whole bunch of work stuff so i've just been in a flow state for a while just working you know uh, but now it's 4 15 and i teach in 45 minutes so i'm heading over to the studio now so that i can teach and i'll probably record tonight this whole kobe bryant oh it's like shaking me to my core and like i don't really know why um I mean, I wasn't, like, I'm not the biggest fan of basketball, but, like, Kobe dying is really just, like, it's crazy. Like, I, I don't know, it's just, it's, it, I get really sad when I think about it, and, like, his poor wife, like, lost her husband and one of her daughters, like, oh, and I read about all the other passengers. Oh, it's just awful to think about, and it just makes me so, so sad. And I saw this thing on Instagram where I was like, even if like you don't know him, but like you're affected by his death, like that just means like he has such a big outreach in the world. And like that can be applied to like anybody that like your energy can be sent to like anybody and you know, you impact more people than you think. And like, it's just so sad. And like, we all go through life thinking that we're invincible, right? And that like nothing can happen to us. Like, like who would have thought anything would ever happen to Kobe Bryant? Like it's Kobe Bryant, but things happen like it just it make i'm just really shook about it so it's sort of like a sad turn but i don't know i'm just like kobe dying really shook me up yesterday and still today like i was in yoga this morning and during um savasana i was just thinking about him like the whole time and like his poor daughter like they must have been so scared it just breaks my heart to think about it, it really does all right, though. I'm gonna go to spin. I'm gonna go. Uh, hi, guys. I my hair dyed. Hi, hi, how are you? Hard at work. Gab's on stage. We're going in. Four more. 
<laughs> Good morning, guys. The next day. <laughs> um, my camera ran out of uh, storage because I literally had videos on here from like, what month is it? January? I literally had them from like November or like October, so, so long ago. The video literally cut off as Gab started to teach last night, which is so unfortunate because she was so freaking good. But she's going to be teaching tonight in Jess's class, so I'll sneak in and get some footage for you guys so you guys can see Gab. Gab is starting, um, by the time this vlog is up, she probably has already started, um, but she's so good. So if you guys ever visit Stride or you go to Stride, hey, um, go check out Gab. She's insane and so amazing. So it's nine o'clock right now. I got up around like 5 30 ish. Um, and I have just been working since I'm in a real, like I need to get a lot of work done. So I'm just in like a flow state right now of work. Um, and I'm going to the studio around like 3 30 today. And then I'll be there probably until like 7 30 or eight. And then, um, I really want to go lift tonight. So I didn't want to lift this morning. I literally just wanted to like start working, but I'm going to make breakfast really quick. Um, I don't really know what I'm like in the mood to eat. I'll show you the best avocado toast too. Like you will really thank me later. Everybody knows this, but everything but the bagel by Trader Joe's is the best. So then you pack that on. Here's the secret sauce, glaze. Okay, this is the balsamic vinaigrette glaze from Trader Joe's. This will transform your avocado toast. Kind of losing my motivation here to uh, get some work done. It's 10.40 now, so um, yeah, I've been working for a couple hours now and I'm just like finding myself wandering and like not really doing much, so I think I should take like a little break, go shower, I'm thinking, and then come back down here, like make a matcha and then go in my office and work in there and then like get in, get into a groove in there, but I think I need a little break, so I'm gonna chill for like four minutes and then go up and shower. Well, it's technically a different company. Is that okay? That doesn't matter. Okay. Let's make lunch. And this is just like a big salad that will hold me over until I could probably go to the studio. So yeah, that's lunch. So it's 3.30, I've spent at six, but Gab is doing a mock bar class at uh, four. So I'm getting ready for that. I, um, I don't always wear makeup when I go to teach, but like if I have like tan on my face, I normally don't, but my face is really pale. Like I tanned a little, little bit after my shower today, but like nothing too crazy. Hey Siri, remind me at 7 p.m. to post an Instagram picture. Siri's literally like my little assistant. She always reminds me of things. I do that all the time. This morning I woke up, rolled over, looked at my phone, had a message, and I was like, oh, I have to do that. And I literally was like, hey Siri, remind me to do this at 10.45. I'm watching way too many TikToks. Which like all my friends were like, download TikTok. And I was like, no, because I know how I am. I'll just get like super addicted to it. Like, no. And wouldn't you know, I'm super addicted to it. It's like Vine energy, you know? And Vine was like our purest time ever. I would say as a society, like I think we were really together during Vine. Like we would all just kind of have like this secret language that not everybody knew, but like, enough people knew it where like we could kind of communicate you know what i mean so it was like a, it was a crazy time like yeah i go back to philly tomorrow i really like miss it i could go back tonight but that wouldn't really make sense because i just have to be back here like super early tomorrow morning so wouldn't really make much sense but i can't wait to get back to philly tomorrow i think we're gonna make a stride tiktok oh i need some dry shampoo in my life this is the best smelling dry shampoo ever. I only have it in a travel size, but it's the Morocco oil, Moroccan oil dry texture spray. Oh, is this not? Oh, this isn't dry shampoo. Good thing I just put that in my root. All right, let me just change really quick. Gas class is at four, and I told all the girls to be there at 3.45, and I was like, I thought it was 3.30, and then I looked at the clock, and it was 3.42, and I'm like, 
Wait, holy shit, I have to be there right now. I'm so dumb. Why am I the way I am? Okay, we'll see you at the studio. Hello. <laughs> you know that um, meme of that little girl that walks in with their teddy bear to her room and it's like captioned this on Twitter and she's like, Hello, Hello. yeah. <laughs> I just hear the beep. <laughs> Hi, we're matching in a different color. Uh, well, once this washes out, it'll turn this color. Oh, perfect, so I wanted that color. Hi guys, so Tori's teaching, and Jess and I are talking to Olivia. Say hi. And uh, there's Gab. Gab taught her um, staff bar class today. It was so good, like my legs already hurt, and we only took it like an hour ago, not even, like, no, more than that, like two and a half. <laughs> so, Mia and McKenna are working tonight, and Tori's teaching right now, and Mia's on stage. Do you wanna say that's Tori's vlog? And Tori's on stage, but I don't know if I should go in, because I'm like bad at recording, so should I? She might want it since she brought the camera, but let's not. It's about to be your song. My they song? just finished Wait. Oh, that's a bad time to go in. Yeah, don't do it. She usually, she keeps the lights off anyway. Should I do like the last song, maybe? She keeps the lights off usually. Oh, then I'm not going in. I'm sorry. She didn't really tell me, so I'm hoping not, but um, next in the spin room is Gab and Jess, because Gab teaches her first class on Sunday, and my legs are so bad. And the babies are playing. Hudson! Look! Oh. Who's that chubby baby? Oh, yeah. oh. oh, I'm vlogging. This hurts my arm. Jesus, how do people do this all day? It's gonna be done in like 10 minutes, and I have to pee and do my job. So, OOTD is our new. <laughs> I'm giving them an OOTD, outfit of the day. OO? -O? Yeah, OO. -O. Uh, outfit of, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. So my stride badge that I made, our stride full zip, down and up. And on the back, so stride, anchor black, Lulu's. And my Adidas shoes, not sponsored. <laughs> Let me tell you about, yeah, not sponsored, obviously. Gloves are drying, wash is being done. I just love this place. Oh, look at this new merch, this new sweatshirt. Stride, we have onesies and everything. And this, this is so soft, love it. It's all online. Get yours true by yours truly, Tori and Jess. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, I'm going to end the vlog. I'm back in my Philly apartment, so I'm going to say goodnight to you guys. Um, and I'll talk to you guys probably not tomorrow because I'm doing something that I can't show yet. But I'll definitely be back on Thursday and vlog on Thursday. And yeah, I'll probably show you guys my weekend because I think I have a pretty fun weekend in the books. So... Yeah, all right, I'll talk to you guys then. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Hope you guys all enjoyed this video and um, I'll talk to you guys very soon. Goodbye.